Good morning. So I have some catching up to do. We have been working on insulating and roofing for two good hard days now. The idea was that we would have it all insulated and roofed in a single day. And I really thought I had my ducks in a row to make that happen. <sighs> That's the story of this whole project. It's so amazing how easy it is to miscalculate things. But, um, crossing my fingers that today will be the day don't have any idea the confidence I have <laughs> in uh, the metal roof. <sighs> There's a lot of things to clear up. But we're going to give it our best shot because tonight it's supposed to rain. Um, it could start anywhere between 3 and 9 o'clock in the evening. <sighs> Wish me luck. The deal is though We've been pushing so hard. I haven't been carrying my camera around with me. And it's uh, really to a detriment to you guys. I'll try to take my camera up there and point out what I've done so you can see what's going on. It was really repetitious, boring stuff anyway, right? Anyway, <laughs> I've been working so hard on this project to get it done and it's just not getting done. I'm breaking myself on it. But whatever. Uh, you're <laughs> just doing what I can do here. Let's see if we can get it done today, huh? So I can't tell how well you can see this or not, but the eave and the bird block has a gap in between and the air will come up underneath the eave through the gap and up above the insulation here. And so the screen is here to help protect the, you know, keep the bugs out a little bit <laughs> anyway, to screen that airflow. This is what the ring looks like now that it's on. All the metal panels will fit to this metal ring. It's coming together, looks kind of neat. All of the insulation is now in, two layers, R15 on the bottom and R23 on the top. We also have an extra piece of wood on top of the rafters to make sure there's airspace. 
Time for the roof to go on next. This is cool. All of these roof panels are held together by these bolts. Bolt to this heavy metal ring at the top. Then you attach the roof panels to each other and then again to the eaves at the bottom and that's all that holds this roof on. I think it's awesome. Okay, so I have some ventilation skirting that goes around the ring here, this top ring. So I'm installing it around. Pretty simple stuff. <laughs> it's like a suit of armor. Plate mail. Anyway, a little bit of a nerd side here. <laughs> this putty of whatever sticky brand it is that'll create a seal on metal, metal to metal seal. Works pretty good. Anyway, it goes on pretty much like this. Pretty straightforward. Hey guys, thanks for watching. I'm in the process of editing the video here in the yurt. <laughs> I have the generator set up outside. It's a comfortable place to work instead of that cramped camper. But I need to tie up some loose ends. Man, I did a really poor job of recording anything during that project. Please forgive me. But yeah, I'll tell you, we finished the roof just barely in time. <laughs> we uh, had rain start to fall as we set the skylight in place and we set the skylight in place for the night and the next day I went and finished it up so I could take the scaffold back. We had some people, some friends that we've made in the area come and help us at a few points along the way. Many, many, many thanks to all of you. You guys know who you are and 
man, it was just so good to have help to make that happen. Silly me for thinking I could do that in a day. Man, it took a lot of hard effort. And Audrey and I really had to take a break. It's part of the reason why there was a gap of two weeks that you guys didn't see a video. We just kind of crashed. It was a great project and thank you for all of your support watching our channel. Uh, we've had some great progress lately and thank you, thank you, thank you for all of that. We have some projects. We're still working with our bees, have some bee videos to send your way. Uh, we're working on a septic tank right now. We're putting in the septic system. That will happen over the next week or two and then you'll have a video on that. Good things coming. Thanks for watching and thanks for taking this journey with us on Simple Ground.